Yeah, we're looking forward to that later. But next tonight, the 14-year-old boy campaigning to save his post office in Cheshire. It's one of two and a half thousand under threat. So tonight, at their busiest time of the year, we're asking how much sympathy do you have for the people who run them? Or do you think, with the post office losing £3 million a week, it's time for some drastic action? Ashley Derricott has this report. Child's play, it's certainly not. Excuse me, is there any chance you could sign this to save the local post office? Yes, yeah, sir. Thank you. Thanks. Max Eden once had to pretend he was an adult just to get taken seriously. But now the 14-year-old has more than 2,000 names on his petition. I don't want my local post office to shut down because it's always busy. It's very handy for stamps, cards and send parcels. And it's a vital part of the community. There's been a post office in the Fullshaw area of Wilmslow for more than 50 years. But last month it was earmarked for closure. There are quite a few shops on, uh, on sort of Chapel Lane, but, uh, you know, if one of them closes, then uh, it could be the demise of all of them. Everyone uses the post office. We can't do without it. What's wrong with going to Tesco's? It's awful to go. I can't walk that far. One lady said to me when I met her here, she said, I don't know how I'll cope in Wilmslow. They're friendly to me here. I won't know anybody there. I'm frightened of them. We've spoken to the postmaster of this post office and although he wouldn't go on camera, he did tell us that over the last 10 years his takings are down some 40%, much of that because more people are doing more and more by the internet. He also told us that the post office had been up for sale for two years but no buyers had come forward. Nonetheless, Max's campaign has gathered pace and he appears to have some pretty heavyweight political support. The local MP also happens to be shadow chancellor. They provide a vital local service. And at a time when we're debating uh, how we keep our communities together, I don't know why we're closing post offices. Is there any chance you could sign this to save the local post office? Yes. Consultation on this and two and a half thousand similar closures ends next week. The post office accepts it's inconvenient, but claims it can't continue losing over £150 million each year. Ashley Derricott, Grenard Reports, Wilmslow. Yeah, and people are always moaning about the youth of today, eh? And at the busiest time of the year for our post offices, we want to know how much you rely on yours. Is it a vital part of your community?